Hello everyone and welcome to the second episode of our Road to IPL Glory with the RCB unit again. The Royal Challengers Bengaluru are back. We're two from two to start IPL 2024 in this game, which is actually honestly a shock to me, mainly because Cam Green is an absolute gun. He really did show his class in the last two games with the bat. He's been outstanding. He really has. We're going to hope for more of that today. We have made a couple of changes just to kind of see things out. Chow Hands made his way in, as well as Vyshak, I think that's how you say that. And Reese Topley has replaced uh, Lockie Ferguson for now. We'll see how that plays out. Up against the Chennai Super Kings. Let's see how we go. Can we go three from three? The, C the Super Kings, or CSK if you will. Nobody ever calls them the Super Kings. CSK do really act outrate us as you can see here four stars to three so this is going to be a tough game despite us sitting in second very early days that csk sides quality all the way down we've won the toss i say we won the toss we've lost the toss we've been put into bat don't know where i got the idea that we won the toss but anyway we're going to start things off with the bat so where does the predictor see us right now not in a great way not in a great way. Predicted score of 185, which we will take. But it looks like about a 40-60 game going on. Rough estimations here. To start us off, Coley first ball of the match. Cut away for four. So that's a good way to begin, though. That is a good start. Hopefully, signs of things to come. Oldham. That is a beauty as well. That core brings it back. That was a ripper. Look at the way this jagged back. Oh, yeah. My ball. Nine, nine for one. Padded out to the crease. Down the ground immediately off the mark with a boundary. Nice. Good shot. Good classic cricket shot. Oh, it's up as she has miscued it, but it's four. Goodness me. That was a lot more streaky. That's for sure. Oh, yeah. Coley up and over. One bounce for four. Just flicks it off his hip. Good work. Gonna go again, I think, here. Coley. And... Daryl Mitchell, it's a great catch at first slip. A classic Collie dismissal, dare I say. Driving away from his body, taken at first slip. Brings to the crease. Chauhan, I think, will come to the crease now. I think there's no reason for him to be any lower than here. Especially as a former opener, or at least normally likes to open, if he can. 25 for 2, not a great start, have to say. Nice shot off the back foot. That was great timing. Raced away. Chauhan. Playing a miss. Another playing a miss. Mitch Satner into the attack here for the CSK side as well. Nice. Swept away. That's going to be four. Unlucky. Mitch there. 35 for two. Oh, he's bowled him. He's yorked him. He's gone for the sweep. It was far too, far too full for that shot. Chowhan's gone six off six. His IPL to boot. Not worked out here today for us. Has he actually has he played in the IPL before? That is a good question. No, that was his IPL debut. Run a ball six and he's gone. So it's Padadar and Maxwell, 35 for three. Oh, that is six though. That is six runs into the crowd. I think this is at the Chinnaswami as well. So I think like 200's par. That is going to be four. Six and a four from Padadai. He's looked the best of the batters so far today. Oh, my stumps, but he still manages to beat the player in the deep. Despite the dive. Goes in vain for four. Six, four, four. Four. Again beats that deep mid-wicket fielder. Just the one. Maxwell gets no runs from five deliveries. We're actually okay with Maxwell taking his time, I think, in this game. There he is. He's off the mark. He's got, he's got such aggression and power later in his innings. I feel like he can catch up in just a moment of a, you know, blink of an eye stuff. That is six runs from Padded Up into the crowd. The crowd does love it, the home crowd. Oh, down the ground. I think that'll be his 50. Yes, it is. He raises the bat for a 50, Padded Up. A six and a four to bring it up. I think that's off 20 balls. Oh, and he's gone again. That could be six, and it is just one bounce. Just shy of the rope. 6-4-4. Four, four. Oh. Tries to repeat the dose. 
Swing and a miss. Oh, oh. short. Oh, no, it doesn't get up, though. Just skids through from Jadeja. Oh. oh, and again, three players and misses. That is the fastest 50 for Padadar. 20 balls for the RCB team against CSK. Wouldn't have picked that, to be fair. Very strong in the batting unit in the past, but nonetheless, 20 balls is still pretty quick. Pretty good stuff, yep. I mean, let's just keep going. We're sitting in a good position for a good score. We just need to not lose many more wickets, you know, and then we can really attack at the end. Good on drive from Maxwell. That's four. I love seeing Maxwell actually bat slow. It's good to see because he's a, he's a, he's a quality player. He can catch up in no time. That's sliding down, sliding down. Yeah. So there's no need for him to rush out of the, out of the gates too much, but it doesn't matter today. He's got a start and he's gone for 7 off 16. Not what we would have wanted, but I appreciate that he's trying to take his time. I, I like that much more. It's left us in a better position than if he slogged from ball one and got a golden duck, that's for sure. Cam Green to the crease in top form, of course. Going to need all of it today. Padadar's on 60 off 29. Nobody else has really got out the blocks at all. Maui Nally into the attack. Oh, nice. Up and over. Mid-wicket. That will be four. Padadar, if he keeps going, is an outside chance of 100. Because he's still got eight overs left and only 40 to get. But he's going to have to blitz it at some stage. We don't have a lot of batting behind us. That's the only real problem. 95 for four here. Gone, though, Green. Yep, he's gone across the line. That's Plum. He's got to go. Seven off ten. Kartik to the crease. What can DK provide here? He's normally a finisher, so he's coming quite early. Oh, no. Is there a long off? There is. First ball, and he's gone. He's holed out. That's disappointing. Lomraw to the crease. Hattrick ball. Not to be, but Padadar's got it all to do here. That's a shot. That's going to be four. Brings up the 100 for the side. But RCB in all sorts of trouble at 100 for six. Oh, yes. Quality on drive, though. That's going to be four. Class apart so far today. But we're going to need him to kick on here because nobody else is going to help him out, it seems. That's another boundary. He moves to 73. Seven overs remain. Moeen Alley again. Lomra on strike. Playing a miss. Just not quite understanding the pace of the wicket so far. Nice. Good shot off the back foot. That will reach the rope for a boundary here. Going to go straight and out. Does, but over. Six. Off the back foot from Lomroar. Ten off the over. We'll take it. Shaha is back, though. He's the key sort of player. Oh, this is a real chance, I dare say. Ravindra into the attack. This is, a, this is takedown stuff. This is, like... I know Ratch and Revenger's quality, but still. Yeah, you've got to take your chances when you get him. This is a potential chance here to catapult our score. Because he is a good bowler, but still, he's not as good as the other ones. That's six. Six, and that's gone. That one's a long way back from Padada. He moves into the 80s, I think. Oh, he skewed it, and he's dropped. He's dropped as well. Mid-off puts down a sitter. Two hands to it. Revendra will be cross, very cross. But he's bowled him. Doesn't matter. It does not matter. He's gone for 88 or 40. He's thrown away 100, but he's done a tremendous job. That's the best seventh wicket stand against the Chennai Super Kings for RCB. Now we're in a real, real strife here. 88 from 40. Look at the rest of the scorecard. Oh, it's just tough reading that. Top leap. I don't know what he's going to do. Oh. Yeah, pretty much that. So, four overs left. At this point, Lomroar needs to just retain the strike, I think. That's her best chance of scoring any runs. Nice. Cut away. That will be four. Couple of dots again. We don't oh. mind it. We, we want to try and retain the strike where we can. Cut away. That's six. Hasn't worked in this over, but it's got us an extra ten runs. Top leap. Against Ravindra again here. Yeah, that's out. Just angled it in. Didn't spin. Plum. Did not spin. 
Yep, straight on with the arm. Four ball duck for Topley. Suraj to the crease. Does get a single. That's good. Lomrell's back on strike. Oh, it's up Ish, but it's over. He skews it. He was going over mid wicket, but just skewed it off the outside edge of his bat. Ended up going straight down to mid off, but I think he just got enough timing on it for four. Obviously, he did. So, two overs left. Does Lomrell go for it or wait? I think he's going to wait one over. Still got one over left. If he gets out, then he's, you know, we're screwed anyway. What is this missing? Leg. Okay, fair. Nice drives. Beats the short cover. That's four. And he does retain the strike here. So now he can just go for it because it's last over stuff. Nice. What a shot. One bounce four. One, six, four. Oh, that could be one bounce four again. One, six, eight. Four left. It's an edge in the gap. Would you believe it? The luck is turning. That's another boundary. Three in a row. Another edge, another boundary. Lom Raw. Buy a lotto ticket. It's going great. Oh, an edge for one. And that is the innings. 177. Great work. That's 50 from Lom Raw off the last ball of the innings. Fantastic stuff. His 12th T2050. Although I don't imagine he's got many in the IPL, if any. He's got none for Rajasthan. Just his second for Bangalore. So that's pretty awesome there. Great stuff. Would you believe it? Yeah. 50 off 30, not out. 88 from 40 for Padded Up. And honestly, what a what a weird scored card. What, what did I say there? What a weird scored card. I mean, that is 11 to 88, 677 Duck. 50 not out. Duck, one not out. Well, good stuff from Lomroar to really finish that innings out. That was quality. Outstanding stuff of just retaining the strike and giving ourselves a chance. And that's exactly what we did. Satna bowled well. Shaha bowled exceptionally well up front. He really took tap in that last over. But other than that, and was also pretty luckless. We had a couple of edges for four in that last over, which definitely did help. Ravindra, a couple of wickets. Gutsy going to him, but it actually paid off. I would say, I would say Moeen bowled more economically, but then again, Ravindra got the wickets, and that's what was needed at the time. 127 all out for the Kings. Now we're up against... Trying to chase, or trying to defend, 178, going at 9 per over. Our bowling attack, definitely not favorable. So there, look at that, already. It's saying basically, what, 2080, essentially, against us. Not great. We're going to have to get some wickets up top to try and change that. Oh, that's a good shot from Ravindra. Up and over, points. It's four, bit of width. Yeah, that's too straight to Guy Quad. Loves it on his pads. That's four. So not a great start. Whipped away. And it will just about get there as well. Not terrible though. Six, is it? Yes, it is. A flat one too. Just about gets there. Oh, down the ground, Ravindra. Top quality shot. 37 without loss. These two firing out the gates. Going to go to Vyshak, who's going to bowl his medium pace here. Take the pace off the ball. Oh, huge though. First ball of his campaign goes for six. And the second ball will go for six as well. Oh, dear. Well, again, we're doing this for contract reasons. We're trying to see if they're any good. Because next year we can really make the big changes. But we can't do that if we've never seen them play. Six, six, four. Six. Wow, this this could be one of the great IPL overs. It won't be, though. Just a couple of singles to finish out. Oh, dear. That really was not a good way to finish the power play. We haven't even finished it yet. Oh, my goodness me. On top of the bounce. Against Cameron Green. Ravindra. Oh, backs away. Even better. Four more. Oh, now he's pulled it. Cameron Green. Any danger of pitching one up? 76 for none after the power play. What a disaster. Long roar into the attack. The game, honestly, feels done already. But again, we're going to get a lot of this the first year. This is always a struggle the first year, but it's always worth a try. Someday we will actually win in the first year. Probably not with this ICB unit, though.
if we actually picked any winning team, to be fair, we probably could win in the first year. Like the Perth Scorchers or, you know, the eventual winners, KKR, maybe. Uh, do we want to bowl green again? Not really. Let's try Maxwell. Let's try our luck with double spin here. Not great. Not terrible either. Now it's terrible. That's six. Yep, 98 for none. Cruising on any sort of ship right now. That's, again, down the ground. Four more. 50 for Guy Quad. What is going on? 57's the par, and they're on 103. Mental stuff. Can anybody grab a wicket? Any danger? In the gap. Ravindra, that's four. Sometimes they'll position a two good, though. They're really showing that tonight. Oh, that's quality. Even though it's just a single. It's going to be 54, Ravindra. Off 28 balls. Going to have to try and find a wicket. I think we've got to go to Suraj here. Got to try and use your gun players in the situation. Oh, just a quality drive, though. Not that bad a ball. Still finds the road. That is well. That's probably the shot of the day. Inside out. Through extra cover. That's four. Sliding down, unfortunately, but not, not terrible. Oh, that could be in the gap as well, and it is. It's just great batting. It really is this game. Quality batting from CSK right now. And he's nicked off, though. Lomroar does pick up the first. Ravindra does have to walk for 62 off 34. What an innings. CSK well in front of this game. We're going to need three quick wickets if we've got any chance. And Guy Quad hits that for six. His T20 average is 38.98. I mean, that is incredible. We're going to go Topley, I think. Don't have a field for him, though. So we're going to have to change it up. Mid wicket, long on, long leg. Square leg up. Third, covers. And then everybody else in the ring. So point, square leg. Extra cover. Covers are back. Move point around a bit more. Yeah, that's it. Beautiful. That will do. Thank you. Okay, Topley here. Oh, slow ball, and he's picked the bones out of it. He just absolutely saw that coming. Oh, an outside edge, and it's going to be for a bit of luck, but they deserve it at CSK at this point. Been very, very good, but Moeen's gone. Good comeback there from Topley. 13 from 7. He gets his first wicket. Daryl Mitchell to the crease. 28 needed. Going to give the medium pace for another go. Bowls a great over. Uh, Got to bowl your best bowlers out. Let's go Topley again, I think. See if he's any better than Lockie Ferguson. Has turned out to be, though. Well, marginally. Marginally. 10 and over is not fantastic. He's really there for power play wickets, which he did not technically get. Guy Quad. Don't know what he's on right now, but must be close to 100. That is 6. 87 he's on right now. That He will not get there. Suraj will bowl the final over of the game, I think. Two to win. One to win. And there's nobody there. It's a single, and that's the game. Guy caught 89, not out. Ravindra 62. Job done, really, for CSK there. Just no penetration with the bowling, as expected. That's just how it goes with this RCB side, especially in the first year. 2-1, we are. Our run rate is terrible. That is terrible. To be that high with a poor net run rate definitely says something. We're going to be up against Rajasthan. Close games, though. Ooh, 211 plays 209. 206 plays 170. Guy Quad got 100 in, in the next game. He did get, what, 89 not out. Makes sense. But they still lost. Abhishek Sharma, 128. Last place, luck now. Kolkata in ninth. Early days, though. On the runs, Guy Quad, Ravindra, Sudarsan, Green up there, 75. Shaw, 
Padada, 121. Honestly, oh yeah, I was going to say, we're not even going to be close. Yeah, Sarai is close. First couple of games did well. Nobody else that close. Uh, yeah, I can't believe we're three stars. We're terrible. We really are. Very terrible. This year, 31 at 13. I guess let's just keep going around. Let's go Joseph next. Let's just try everyone. We'll see. Like, it's going to average out. Someone's got to do well eventually, right? Could try Will Jacks instead of uh, Glenn Maxwell. That was actually his worst bat, though. His bowling was pretty average, though. Let's try it. I reckon let's try it. Let's try Sharma here. He's never... Oh, what? Hermanshu Sharma's never played a game. He's uncapped. Let's try Rewat then, I think, is the, is the play for, for me here. Otherwise... Yeah, we'll see if Jax is any better than uh, Maxwell. That's pretty much the only change. Lomron did take a wicket there. Expensive stuff, but yeah. Oh, uh, and then Vyshak, uh, I think, is going to not play. I think that's the play. We're going to go... We could go Akash deep. Is that right? I'm thinking more Kumar, maybe. Yeah. Let's try that. Oh, we've got a spinner here. Daga. We do have two already, though, with Lomroar. Oh, Daga can't bat. I don't know. Yeah, we can try it. It does weaken our batting, though. But as long as we know that, then that's fine. Okay. Well, it, our rating has improved. I don't know who improved it, but our rating has gone up to four. So that's good. Any surprises in the Rajasthan lineup? Rathor, I suppose. Is someone different? Uh, Kotian? No Trent Bolt. That's a bit of a shame. wonder where he's at. I wonder if he's uh, got injured or something. We are going to bowl. We're definitely going to chase. Definitely going to chase. What's the predictor stating? Rajasthan's slight favorites. Looking at 183 projected. It would be a par. 180, okay? Remember that. And he's gone first ball. Jaiswal. Nicked off. Bad luck. Gone for a golden duck. Great start. Sandrew Sampson to the crease. Oh, he belts it straight past him. It's four. Siraj was in for an opportunity there for a half a second. Classic Sandrew Samson, Samson shot off the back foot. Effortless. Oh, wow. What a shot. Over extra cover. Four. Alzari Joseph. Expensive, but he's a wicket taker. So we'll see how this plays out. Six, I think. Yeah, he's nailed it. But look, off the back foot. Down the ground. Siraj. Expensive, but got a wicket. Again, through extra cover with power. Gone, I think. Yes, he is too. I thought it was... It was struck outside the line, I was going to say. I thought it struck him outside the line, though. But I had a feeling he was going to give it regardless. And it was struck outside the line. So I was right. On both accounts, he did give it out. And yes, it wasn't out. Wow, well, well. DRS in the game. There is none. He's got a walk. 26 for two. Siraj has two wickets early doors. Moves to 10 for the season. Dot one, dot one. It's an edge, but I don't think anybody's going to get there. It's going to be four. Good luck there for Butler. Bad luck for us. Siraj again, I think. He's been very good for us this season. Already got 10 wickets. It's going to be four. We're going to go to Kumar. Oh, he's cut it, but it's gone all the way. 
player out there, but he's absolutely nailed it. Only eight off it, though, so that's not a not a terrible outcome. Going to bring Will Jacks to the bowling crease for an over. See how he plays out. Any better than Maxwell? Probably not, because they're both all-rounders, and it's tough to bowl as an all-rounder. Yeah, pretty much what I expected. Bowl pretty well, and then hit, get hit for 1-4, and your figures look a little bit more average, but that's all right. We will go... Let's try Dagger, I think. The, or Daga? Dagar? Dagger? I'm not entirely sure how to say his name. Apologies. Uh, that's going to be 67 for 2 after 8. Let's go a couple more. Like one more for Jax, and then we'll assess again later. Man, good drive. It's going to be 4 from Jarrell. Not a bad over, though. Bowling all right, Jax. Don't mind it. Left arm up. Would love a wicket here. Oh, sweeps in the gap. Full toss. 80 for two. Yeah, they're really starting to get a move on here, Rajasthan. It's really worrying signs. We're going to go back to Kumar, I think. Got to try and look for wickets here. Edged and gone. Immediately. He provides the breakthrough and Butler edges off. Great take from DK behind the sticks. That is beautiful stuff. Diving away. Great catch. Needed that. We really needed that. Kumar with another wicket. What's that for this season? Three already. So that's good stuff. Going to give one more to the left arm spinner here. Riyan Parag. Yeah, well, Bob. We uh, struggled to bat with him in the Rajasthan series over on the main channel. That's for sure. Jarrell nicks off and Dega has a wicket. 26 from 21. That's a big moment again. We're just continuing to strike here. Only two wickets away now from the bowlers. So this is good stuff. We're going to go Kumar again. It's an edge. There's somebody down there, but I think it's six. Bad luck. Really bad luck. Yeah, that's, that's how it goes sometimes. Can he finish out the spell well? Rathor. No, 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 no. Swing and a miss. Good stuff. 107 for four. Cut away, six. Too much width and being dispatched into the crowd. Last ball of a spell. Whipped. Well enough for four. Not a great ending. Not a great ending. One for 37. Had uh, one for 27 before those last two balls. That's how it goes sometimes. 21 from 9 from Rathor. Cam Green, I think we'll get a couple here. Cam Green's T20 bowling isn't great. I have to be honest. Like, averaging 50 economy of, like, 9 is, like, actually terrible. I'm really trying to reverse jinx him here, but, like, he's got smashed. So, he's just... <laughs> I should have known. Like, come on, what do you mean? Oh my gosh, of course he gets a wicket after him. After the trash talk comes out. Nick's off. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. That is absolutely typical, of course. Anyway, he has got the key breakthrough. One of them, at least, uh, Cam Green. That's good stuff. Brings Ashwin to the crease. We've got five overs left, which we've got two here, one here, and one here. We should be able to cover out without bowling jacks. He has bowled well, though, so we can look at potentially doing that. I feel like the go here is Kumar to finish off. Let's get him done before the death stuff arrives. Gone again, Kumar! Yes, boy, this is really good stuff here. Two wickets from him. He's been sensational tonight. Can he get number three? No, but it's a great spell. Two for 26 from Rajan Kumar. Fantastic. Beautiful stuff. Well done. Good comeback from that first game that he had. He struggled, but he did take two wickets from memory. Yeah, he did. And he's really delivered tonight. Big time. Green's going to bowl one more, which is frisky. Fraught with danger and risk. Because he is expensive, as I've mentioned before. Just sliding down. Two left. 
Yes, Greeny. He delivers tonight, though. He's delivering tonight. Those are the stats. Look at his stats. I'm not lying either. Like 28, like 48. Sorry, 48. 0.92 with the ball in T20 cricket. At 9.5 and over. What can I say? Not great. But he has fought back today with 2 for 13. And his two overs, two for 14. Beautiful stuff. Alzari Joseph will bowl his third now. It really does help that we're bowling to the bowlers, sort of. Rathor's still here. We've got to get him out. And Andrew Berg is going to cut that away for four, though. This isn't, we need them to be restricted here because they are a good batting, sorry, good bowling unit. We're going to go green again. Risky stuff again, but he's on fire. Green's cut him for six, though. Sorry, Green. Berg is cutting for six. And he's got him out. It's all happening for Green tonight. It is all happening for Green. He's gone. That's plum. Metal stump. Sandeep Sharma to the middle. And he's nicked off for a golden duck. Green's on four wickets. He's looking for five. Yuzi on strike for the hat trick ball. Oh, it's nearly, nearly a hat trick. Edged for four. Frustrating stuff. Last chance to get Yuzi out, and he's bowled him. Green picks up five wickets. The trash talk unbelievably works. The reverse jinx does come out, and five for 24 is what Cam Green ends up with. His figures, I mean, sensational considering his career stats thus far. But again, I guess it just goes to show how good he actually is because his stats and his you know, up until this point, haven't been great. But boy, he delivered tonight. Hit the stumps. Bowled exceptionally well. 5 for 24 for the RCB team against Rajasthan. Fantastic. What can I say? Rathor, 26 unbeaten at the other end. Can walk off in and just kind of slight disbelief that he ran out of partners. Batted through half the side. Green, his first five-wicket haul in the T20 format. His average was 55. It's now 40. I guess that's how early and how, how early he is in his career, yet how impactful that bowling display was on his career stats. Great work. I honestly, I, like, I knew he was always capable, but he just hasn't shown it so far in this tournament. I thought he was going to keep, you know, keep that form going, but he's turned it around today. So that's really, really positive signs for our team. And it's suggesting we're in front of the game by a good margin of 72% right now. So Sandeep Sharma to Kohli gives us a chance to get in this match. But possibly pick up some net run rate. I'm calling that very early. It's definitely not looking like that. We just need to win the game. It's an edge. But the extra bounce doesn't do Kohli in. It still reaches the rope. Around the wicket. Oh, lovely drive. Full toss. Berger going a bit full. 10 off it. The edge does help. Bold him. Faf completely plays all around it. Sharma beats them all ends up. Three off six. He goes for Padadar to the crease. So, how will Padadar face up? Not well. Not well. It seems back and he's plumb. Oh, no. Yep, it was actually Plum. Middle stump. I feel like I say Plum a lot, but that was actually... Yeah, that was dead. Will Jacks. Dear, oh, dear. Started well, but Rajasthan fight back. Sandeep Sham with two and two. He's on a hat trick for his next over. Coley's watched the wickets fall at the other end. He pulls it for six. Good shot. And he's gone. Burgess swings it back. Oh, no. Three, three balls hitting the stumps. Two LBs and a bold. Rewat to the crease. These two have to settle and build a partnership again here. But Rewat immediately skies it and he's taken for another duck. 25 for four. RCB slump even further down. And Cam Green has got to do a lot of rescuing here. Weirdly enough, I actually, I for some reason, I feel like this is a, a silly decision. But I'm going to promote a bowler. I'm going to promote a bowler for just the pure sake of survival. He's going to survive. That's what he's going to do. 
I don't ever think this has been done in T20 cricket before. What is this? Some night watchman in the T20 stuff? What's going on here? We're just trying to ri stop the rot, if you will. Patrick Ball coming up. Nice. That'll be four. Doesn't worry too much. It's Suraj! Suraj got a boundary off the Patrick Ball. Oh, he's got two and two. Oh, what do I know? This is a great move. Oh, this is fantastic. This is probably the best promotion I've ever done. And I think he's gone. Well, hey, I promoted him to try and, I guess, stop the rot, which hasn't really worked. But, yeah, 14 from 6. I'm not going to complain for my number 9, who got promoted to number 6 here. Nonetheless, now Cameron Green's going to walk out. We've got time, team. We really do. We don't have to hit it as much as we did before. So let's just pull it back a bit. See how we go. That's going to be four. Good stuff, Jax. Not a great power play. 28% to win. We, we work best when we have a low win percentage. I don't think anybody's ever said that in the history of cricket before, but nonetheless, here we are. Nice. Good switch hit for four. Six off the over. Perfect over. Yuzi again. Quality leggy. Ooh. Of course, he used to play for RCB, actually. I feel like RCB did much better when he was there, which obviously makes a lot of sense because he's quality. Eight and over needed now. So we're going to up Jax a bit. Cut away nicely. Good timing. 62 for five. Cam Green. Nice. Punches off the back foot through the covers for four. Jax onto 20. 86 required. Not a massive, massive score. You've just got to put some, you know, put a partnership together. And the runs will add up. That's a good on drive from Jax. Gets to the pitch of the ball. Down the ground for four. Again, a good over here. So, Tanush. Kotian. The off spinner. I've never seen him before. Okay, fair enough. Good over. 8.6 needed. Oh, no. He's gone after it, Jax. I think it's in the gap, though. It is. Cries of catch. Go in vain or go remiss, if that's the right word for it. Maybe. I don't know. It's a swing and a miss. Four off the over. Cut away. Well, just short for four. Okay, still a good over. We'll take it. Good stuff. 70 needed at 8.7. Cotian. Down the ground. Good shot from Cam Green. That's four. 90 for five. What can Greeny do here? He's gone. The switch hit and it's worked. Worked again for four. Okay, it's 60. We're back in the par though. But we can't lose another wicket's the real problem for us. Nice. Good. Good stuff. Back foot drive down the ground with the spin for four. Again. Good over, six off it. We're staying in the game. Yes, Greeny, that's great batting. Four more. 50 needed at 8.3. Got DK in the bank still. Couple more overs, and then we're going to try and finish it at the death, I'm thinking. Okay, okay. Turns the face a bit early, but anyway, no damage done. 100 up. Great, great work from Cam Green. Gets the... I mean, it was a full toss. He just kind of punches in the gap for four. 70 partnership against Rajasthan. New all-time record for RCB for the sixth wicket, which makes sense because we sent out Suraj earlier. That actually does help us break a partnership like this. Run a ball from Jax, which has been good until uh, up till this point. Is he going to explode in the right time? I mean, yes. Why, why did I slightly question that? What was my thinking there? Anyway, it's six. Immediately. Good stuff. Off the back foot. Four. Reduces the target by ten runs with just two deliveries. And I think that's his 50 as well, Jax. Comes into the team and makes an immediate impact. Bat and ball. He did bowl well today as well. And he's got a free hit. It's all happening for him today. Down the ground. Don't get run outs the key thing. 
Oh, he's gone though, on the free hit. Trying to take advantage, 50 or 44, he's got to go. Just when the game was looking in the favor of RCB, he departs. 30 off 24 now, and the game back in the balance. Oh, DK skews it, that's a brilliant catch! What a catch from deep mid-wicket, oh my gosh. Nandri Berger pulls out one of the screamers of the tournament. And DK's gone for a duck. I can't believe it. I thought it was going to be safe for sure. Didn't think he was going to get there. I thought he was going to drop short. He's gone though. That is a big moment. Joseph to the crease. A wide. A four. Great work from Alzari. That all counts. Well, what, 21-ish away? Oh, yes. Back-to-back -back boundaries for Joseph. 133. Oh, he goes the switch hit and nearly gets bowled. He's good, though. Cam Green's got it all to do here. 21 off 18. Run rate's not an issue. Wickets are. Yes, he flicks it away. Flatter and faster into the pads from Chahal, but it's gone wrong for four. He basically retains the strike here. Oh, yes, and Joseph nails one. Going for that swat of a reverse sweep. And all of a sudden, we need to run a ball here. Oh, I can't let Cam Green go, go after it too hard, though, because if he gets out, like, the game's over. Oh, no. Okay, I think 10 off 8. He's got it. He's got it in the gap for four. One win, one win away. One shot away. Six or seven. Five off. Okay, he's he retained the strike. Okay. Andrew Berger to bowl the final. What's the predictor stating? 0 0.5 for a draw? Really? It's five from six. I mean, it's not, not out of the question. Just four runs off the last over. Seen it plenty of times. But anyway. Oh, he gets the single. Gutsy. Three from three. He's got to retain strike now. Three from three. Nails it. Game over. Cam Green yet again. He's the hero. What can I say? He's done it all season and he's done it again. Fantastic work. Three wicket win for the... I keep saying for the RCB unit, but you know, for RCB here. Great stuff. What a win. Fantastic stuff. Cam Green, player of the match. <laughs> I actually... I temporarily forgot he got five for 24 and he's got 49 not out off 34. What a game. What a player. Seriously, this is him at his best. Didn't show it in real life. Perhaps why I thought he was not going to show it in this game. But in this game, he's been outstanding. Wow. He's been the difference maker for this. For this side. So far. For Bengaluru. Fantastic stuff. Okay, I've got some training to do. So I'll quickly do that. Before we play our next game. Just the one change for us here. Chowhan comes in. Otherwise, the bowling unit actually performed much better than I expected from this game so far. Or from this unit so far. So, that is promising signs. I thought we were going to have to struggle a lot longer to find a sort of bowling combination that was going to work. Is it early days and probably will, un, you know, probably will undo itself in this game coming up? Probably. But the signs are there for, like, actually, we found, we found a balance that could perhaps pull us through deeper in this tournament. Green averaging 99 is just out of this world so far. So let's just take a look where he actually sits for the season. Where does he sit right now? Does he sit top of the tree? Not quite. Third spot. But, I mean, averaging 99.5. Crazy stuff. Right up there with Guyquad. And he's got a five-wicket haul to his name. Although he's going nearly, you know, 11 and over. But nonetheless... Suraj up there as well for the wickets. That's really important. Okay. Kolkata, though. They're a top side. They're only in seventh right now. Is that because they just won or lost again? They did win one, but they lost another one as well. So everyone in the competition has a win. Early doors. Okay. And we are currently in th uh, fourth because we are 3-1. I'm shocked we are winning this much this early. I'm actually shocked. So... That's something. We need, what, five more wins? 
That's actually crazy. I mean, I can actually see that now. We've got 10 more games. We only need to win half of them. And we're in the knockouts. Because eight's the magic number. Don't let's not get the hope. Let's not get the hope up too much, though. Five wins is still a lot. Still plenty of season to play. And we're gonna play yet again against Kolkata Knight Riders here today. Five-star team, we're a four-star team. We've lost the Tossimal Ball first. I actually think that works in our favor. I'm happy with that. So, Siraj will go again. What's the predicted score? 61% for them, 183 again. So, 180 is about par. And this 60-40, okay. So, they're slight favorites, but not by much. Good bars. First ball of the game. Six runs. Slogs it away and immediately up and running. Cut through the offside. That's four. Okay, so again, not a great first over there. Elzari. Oh! Had luck. He's actually a good ball. Salt. That's four runs. Good timing. Gonna have to survive this onslaught from these two. I don't know how, but we're gonna have to try and do it. Six runs. Oh, it's an edge, but it's in the gap. Fortune favors the brave here. 39 for none. Do we turn to someone different? Maybe. One more over. Oh, he skewed it up. Hasn't got the pace on it. Yes, he's gone. Beat him for pace, I think, there. Phil Salt, 19 off 9. Coley takes the catch in the end. A good one. Shriss Iyer to the crease. So, a wicket has kind of, I wouldn't say halted their momentum, but made them think twice a little bit here for KKR in terms of how hard do they go. They seem to not really matter too much, though. That's four more. No Narine in this side, which is a bit of a shock, I have to say. I think that's missing off. Struck outside the line, so... Ooh, not by much, though. Umar. Oh, six, I think. Yep. Yep, on the hip. And I think we'll go to Cam Green for the last in the power play here. Oh, great stuff. Last ball of the power play. It will be six, though. So 67 for one for KKR. Good start from them. We've kind of been in this position before, though. Many times this season. So it's about finding our way out of here now. Oh, no. Good whip, though. Really good timing. On that flick before. Oh, that's that's still actually a good over. Eight off it, I'll take. I'll be very happy with that. We're going to go to Will Jacks here. Test both spinners again. Playing a mess. Good over. Really good over. I think we'll go Dagar here. Oh, sorry. It's actually just Dagar. Oh, good. Good. Good reverse sweep. Pick the, pick the right line for it too there. And I think we'll... Oh, we'll bowl two. Nah, it's fine. We'll just bowl the two overs a spin and see how we go from there. It's in the air. And in the gap. Good buzz. Very lucky player. Just going to throw it out there. 97 for one. Oh, swept away. Doesn't require too much luck there. That's a good shot. Four. 100 out for Kolkata. Cruising. No slip. Spin one more? No. I think something's got to change. I think green into the attack. Try something different. Playing a miss immediately. Skewed. I think he's gone all the way again, though. Yep. Edged it for six. Not great. Kumar into the attack here. We need something to happen right now. They're cruising to 200 plus. It's an edge down to deep third and taken. Kumar comes back and delivers another breakthrough. He's got a golden arm here. Shres gone for 27. Manish Pandey in the team comes to the crease. Oh, that's a shot. That is a shot down the ground. Lovely off drive. Ooh. Shaves his leg stump though, that one. 121 for two. Eight to go. Delicate position. How do we d deal with this here? Let's go Dagar again, I think. 
Need one more wicket. Oh, Gerbaz loves the spin, though. It's four. And again, how has he hit that there? That's frustrating. That is really frustrating. 10 and over. Gerbaz on to 78. Pandey's hit that for six. How did he do that? I think that was on the stumps. Oh, through his legs. Was that from the stumps? Oh, yeah, it was too. Wow. Fair enough. I think Joseph's going to come back for one here. Oh, I bowled on the stumps, on the money. Yes, there we go. Timber. Bundy's gone. 17 off 11. Nitish Rana to the crease. Kumar's one over from bowling out. Can we bowl out with the rest of the bowlers? I don't think so. I think Green's got one left. But Kumar could bowl out now, and I don't mind it. So let's do that. Oh, on drive. That is actually kind of right where we want to bowl, unfortunately. But he's just got enough to get it to the boundary. Okay. That's not bad. We'll take that. 16. So we've got... Oh, no. We can actually... Oh, we've got... Oh, yeah. Dag uh, Dagger. Oh, no. Cam Green can ca cover one death over. I think Suraj bowls now, though. Oh. Bowled. Really well bowled. Oh. Again, well bowled. Good bars on 83, I think. Six. Into the 90s. He goes. Oh, tries to whack that out of the stadium. Green now. Six. Just in the slot there. Down leg, but Wobbold will take the dot. And a good Yorker again. Two left. Suraj to bowl the penultimate. Joseph to close it out. On the stumps, but still six. 180 now. Close. I don't know what that's missing. Is it going over? No, it's going down leg. Just the angle. Yes. Good dots. Yeah, he's gone on 90. Gone on 91, I think. Yep, just got bogged down. Just kept trying to hit it out the park and eventually misses a straight one and he's got to go. That's going to bring to the crease Rinku Singh. We know what he can do. So, what, 31 off the last over he's hit before. So, you never know. Alzari Joseph to start to run up. And he starts with a six. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> Uh-oh, that's four. Six and a four. Okay, it's not clear. What about Alzari Joseph? Hits the pigs. Andre Russell. Oh, my gosh. Catch it. Oh, he's gone for going back. Yes. Dre Russ. Miscues it. Collie takes the easy catch. Mitch Stark to the crease. Hat-trick ball. It's in the air. Oh. I thought he was going to get it for sure. I thought Medon was up. No, he's back. Catches the cry. Will someone get there? Long off. Yes, he takes it. Three wickets in the final over. Cole Carter. See themselves to 193 for seven. That is Joseph five wickets. Wow. That's two fivers in a row for the team. Five for 36. I had no idea he did that. I forgot he took two wickets earlier on, and I guess I didn't do the mass. Three in that over. Nearly got a hat-trick ball. Well, sorry, nearly got a hat-trick. Was on a hat-trick ball, but not to be. 193 for 7. 5 for 36 for Joseph. Just his third T20 FIFA. In 106 games. So, been a while. Got the job done today, though. Can we chase 194, though? This is a big total. Regardless, this is a big total. Real question is, can we chase 194? We do have the batting for it. I, I don't know. It's always tough chasing a good score like this. It really is. Can we find another way? We'll have to wait and see. What's the predictor state we're going to make? 164. So that gives us a 27% chance to win. Give or take 28 there. 
Chakravarti's going to open the bowling. Wouldn't have seen that one coming. From a mile away. No, not at all. First over. And a miss from Coley. Just trying to size up which way it's turning because he is a bit of a mystery spinner. Oh, jeez. Oh, he really doesn't know which way it's turning. Three balls in. Oh, but he's hit it for six, that one. Yes, he has. I thought it was just short. No, six runs. Mitch Stark at the other end. To Faf, who's out of form at the moment. He's like averaging seven, I think. Oh, and he could be out for a duck again, and he is. He's under enormous pressure in this team now. What's his scores? Well, yeah, ever since he's come to, to play for us, he's made 6 18 2 3 duck. Tough. Padada. Well, it's an edge. I think it's six. Let's hope it's six. It is six. It's a long way back. Goes across the line and it's just gone all the way. Fair enough. Chakravati again here. Very interesting to go spin in the power play. Don't see this from the AI too often. That's a good sweep. That's going to be four. I myself am not a massive fan of the spin in the power play, but I like the innovation for it and it's worked. It has worked. Padadar, 12 from 8. Will Jax to the crease. Do we uh, potentially do the strategy from last game? Maybe not yet, because we need 10 and over. It's also slightly different circumstances, I think. The problem is he can't peter along, Suraj. Not that he did last time, but not that he will not go that fast again. Jax, anyway, with Coley. Down the ground. That will be four. Good shot against Stark. Nice. Good timing. Really good timing. Pass 41, so we're slightly behind. Suyash Sharma. The leggy. Uh, playing a miss. Okay, still not a bad over. We'll take that. Mitch Stark again. He's the one danger bowler I'm scared of in this unit, I have to say. Him bowling a third over is not the worst thing in the world. If we can get through it, and we do. So, I feel confident... Or somewhat confident we can hit the other bowlers in comparison to Stark. Stark is a real threat and he bowled three overs so that does help. Okay. Sharma for the moment though. The leggy. Down the ground. Picks the googly. Will be four. We do need 11 per over from here though. Oh that helps. That's all the way. That's huge. What a shot. Crowd goes silent for it. Down the ground. Off the back foot. 4-6-4. Four, four. They like that one better. Okay. The home crowd. I'm not sure why they went silent for a 6 from Coley. But anyway. Stark's going to bowl out. Wow. Gutsy. Nice from Coley. Through the offside. That's 4. We just needed to get through it and we do. So now we can really attack all the other bowlers. Stark's not bowling another delivery in this game. There's no super bowl or anything like that. <laughs> Where you can bowl like... One bowl of five overs. That would be something. That's the next innovation of T20. I've called it here, right? There you go. You're welcome. That's through the covers. That's four. Back to back in this over from Jax. Oh, he's gone. That's, oh, he's gone. The switch and it's worked for six. Picks it very well. Sakaria, the left armor. 10.7 per over needed. Six. Coley. What a shot. Up and over. Deep mid work it. Flicks it all the way. And this time goes offside. Finds the gap. Another boundary. Where's he going to go this time? Oh, he tries to go the same spot. A bit wider, though. Oh, now he's pulled this away. This could be a run out, though. No, it's just a single, thankfully. It's going to be his 50. Yet another one for King Coley. 50 of 32. Good clip, too. Good strike, right? And I'm trying to go the other way, actually, if I can. There we go. That's his first 50 all year. Good strike rate again, though. Really important stuff. What's, what overall is that for this team, actually? Let's take a look. 53rd. Very good. Okay. 10.5 for the final 10 overs. Got the wicks in the shed, but... Got to still score the runs, too. Good start, though. Tossed up and driven over point for four. Oh, 
Oh, nice. Works at leg side. Nobody there. All on the offside in the deep. That's four. That's a good over again. Zachariah. Oh, no. Coley could be run out. Of all things, he's gone. That's the turning point in the match. We've had this before in this game. And in any game of cricket, of course, a run out to change the game, to turn things just when it was looking out of hand. A partnership was developing. The bowlers couldn't get him out. The fielders can. He's run out, Coley, and he'll be bitterly disappointed, if not fuming with Jax. And Jax departs in the same over. Oh, that's 101 of cricket. Don't do that. Walk back to the changing room just as your partner's getting their pads unstrapped. Unbelievable. All of a sudden, the whole game swings open for the opposition here. And we have a whole lot of work to do. Andre Russell to bowl to Cameron Green. Pulled for six, though. Good shot from Greeny. Good over. 11.7. Chauhan, full toss. He'll hit it for six. His first six in IPL cricket for him. On oh, again. Offside this time. Backing away from the stumps. Beautiful shot. All the way. Six runs. Uppercut. Magnificent batting. 20 from 11. 66 off six overs to win the game. Swing and a miss. Pulled. We'll reach the rope. Couple of bounces. Oh, bowled him. Slower one from Andre Russ. Oh, no. 24 from 14. It was a good innings, but it's come to an end too soon for us here. We need 11.4, but we only have bowlers remaining, and I think DK's got to go. Two golden ducks in a row for DK. LBW and Joseph now to the crease. So Cameron Green has it all to do. They run a quick two. Goodness me. Cameron Green's got to do it all, really. It's an edge for one. Oh, the keeper drops it. Swing and a miss. Six. Down the ground from Green. Yet again. I mean, we're asking him to be a hero yet again. It's really... It's, it's, you can't ask for this from a player so consistently to be the hero. But unfortunately, that's what we're doing right now. Who is the keeper? Okay, it is Full Salt, who does drop that catch there. 46 off 24. Chakravati is back after his good first spell. Green, though, cuts him away for four. 150 up. Oh, no. Yep. He's just gone for a big shot. Completely misread the spin on that one. Top edge, and he's got to go. Dre Russ takes the catch, and it's the bowlers now. to hit 42 off 22, and that's game over. So we're going to just pull things back a bit. Yep, it's just a, it, it is what it is. That's disappointing. That run out was the turning point of the game. I said it, and it was right. It usually is when a run out like that happens. That's usually the, the turning point. And it was, and it has proven to be today. Bowl is left. Can't really expect much out of them. Now, I want to say outside leg, but he's going to give it. No, he looked way more shuffled uh, leg side than that. But I guess he's replay. He's got to go. 41 of 15. Yeah, I mean, what else can you do, really? Bowl and that's the game. First ball up. And Kolkata win by an easy 40. Disappointing. We showed glimpses of chasing that down. In fact, at one stage, ahead of the game, at 2 for 100. But, yeah, 8 for 53 is what we lost with that run out. Russ. Dre Russ. 4 for 17. I want to say the game changer, but really he just capitalized on the run out. Which obviously then brought the middle order to decrease, and he did the job. Coley, that was the game-changing moment. I've mentioned it already. Chakravati, 3 for 18. Phenomenal figures. Stark, 1 for 25. We were really just trying to see him out and did a good job of that. We just couldn't 
couldn't finish it out with everyone else that we wanted to attack. That's how it goes sometimes. Kubar's player of the match for his 91 of 53. Jeez, he did get a bit of luck, but that's how it goes. Our run rate is poor, so we're going to have to win for, uh, eight games, so five more games if we're going to make it to the next stage. But we're still winning more games than we're losing, which is even to my, you know, team management self here is a bit of a shock that we've won more than, than we've lost. But yeah, we've done all right then. Runs, Guy Quad, Ravindra. Uh, oh, I, I want to say the name so bad, but I'm going to get it wrong. Uh, Singh, 225. Green, 224. Averaging 74, striking at 179. He's been the savior for our team, really, with the bat. Got that five with the ball. No other wickets, but hey, take the five. Sudarsan up there as well. And then, honestly, no one else to be seen. Wickets, Suraj up there. Bumrah, up. Far too good, though. 11 at 9. Crazy stuff. And honestly, no, one's, no one else is on the wickets here. So we've got some work to do as we play the Mumbai Indians in 7th in our next game. Gujarat, 3-3. Hyderabad, 3-2. Chennai, 3-2. So Chennai are top right now. Rajasthan 2-2, two, two. Kolkata 2-2, two, two. it's pretty even. Honestly, all teams seem pretty even, so this is scary stuff for us. But we'll see how that goes next week, everyone. If you did enjoy this episode of our Road to IPL Glory, then please make sure to leave a like. Subscribe for more content every week over here on James Plays Cricket Captain, and of course over at our main channel, at James Plays Cricket, for more Cricket Captain content or Cricket 24 as well. All that good stuff over there. Leave a comment down below who you think we should pick up in between seasons and if we should make any team changes because I'm always open to who should come into the team and kind of gain experience as we push forward from this year onwards. I feel like this year is sort of the, not the rebuilding year, it's kind of the base year, like the baseline. This is what we're, work, this is what we're working with and then every season from here is going to be how do we better that? What are we trying to, what are we going to cut and then what are we going to keep to try and better that? Otherwise, everyone, I will see you all next week. And as always, take care, everyone.